Hello. In this video, let's see how to use the sampling analytics operation now available within Dataflows in Oracle Analytics. I have this re reasonably large airlines flight data in an Oracle ADW table. Let's briefly look at this project and understand our data set. Flights is the grain of this data set, so I have 5 million rows with flight information spread across 5 years. Here I have the flight distribution by various carriers and I see that Southwest Airlines is the highest carrier with uh, close to 1.2 million flights. Here I'm looking at flights by arrival delay bins and we can see the number of flights in each bin. Okay, this is some initial analysis on this data set, but I want to dig deeper. I want to do some statistical analysis. I want to understand the drivers and influential attributes in this data set and so on. So I want to create a random sample percentage of this data set so I can get a smaller data set to work with. Doing this in Oracle Analytics is now very easy. Let me begin by creating a data flow. Let me add my airlines data set sourcing from Oracle ADW. Let me click on the Add step. We now have a database analytics node here. Note that this will show up only if your input data set is sourcing from an Oracle database or Oracle ADW connection. Here we have a few analytic operations available. I'm interested in the sampling data operation. There is a detailed description on mouse over. It talks about this operation and the underlying DB function that it invokes. Once I select this, I just have to input the sample percent. Let's say I want to create a 5% sample of my input data set. That's it. Let me go and save this data set. I could have some steps before or after this node, but I'm going to keep it simple. Note that the database connection is automatically defaulted to the connection of my input data set. This is because the entire sampling operation is going to happen in the database by invoking a DB function, and the output table is also going to get created in the same database. No data is moved out of the database. Let me specify the data set name and table name and run this data flow. When the data flow executes, the SQL with the aura hash function is pushed to the underlying database where the entire sampling operation takes place and the output table is also created in the same database. Let's briefly look at the session logs to confirm this. Here's the aura hash db function that helps in creating a random sample. Going back to our original project, let's see how the data distribution looks with the new data set. So I'll do a replace data set so I can retain my charts. Let me choose the sample data set that was just created by my data flow. Let me map the month level here and click on replace. So now my project is sourcing from the smaller sampled data set. So we have about 250k rows here. Binning does not look okay after replacing my data set, but I can easily fix this. Let me just drag and drop the arrival delay uh, metric again here to create the bins. There we go. Here's my smaller data set with just 5% random sample of my original data set. Let me toggle back and briefly compare the two projects. I see that the data distribution across both of them looks pretty similar. Here also Southwest Airlines is the largest carrier. I can also do an explain on the smaller data set and look at the distribution of various metrics by the different attributes carrier in this case. So this is how easy it is to create a sample of your input data set in Oracle Analytics. Thanks for watching.